just trying to set up. <clears throat> set up <clears throat> hey what's up guys welcome to our channel remnant success just want to let you know that we're heading to maryland soon most likely around 3 a.m that's how we do our road trips now as a family so the kids are tired wake up energized it's time for me to take a break anyways one day we'll want to own a business one day or you know Basically, any any investment, any anything that can um, provide more for me, for my family, and myself. So, folks, it's Robert, and it's Rosalina. So we're just trying this out. Along the way, when I learn stuff, I always try to talk about it with the people around me, and Rosalina too. There's two conversations, there's two times that I can recall that I had a really great um, conversation with Rosie about businesses and stuff like that. So I did not know that I was going to record this conversation with her. Um, I just want to see you raw, what she may have retained, what she may have seen and what she have heard um, about businesses and stuff like that. Rosie, do you remember us talking about businesses? Mm -hmm. Yeah, and why or what? What do you remember? I remember that when if you're the boss or the owner, you you're gonna wanna um you're gonna be the one who's um like you have to get the employees first, like and then once you get enough, like whenever you get the employees, then you um then you um then you get to pick out how much the money how much money you pay them <laughs> when you are the owner you are the boss you are handling everything um i think i was talking about finances in the sense of you pay yourself last you rather be the boss pay yourself last versus you being you getting paid first at a certain amount and you're kind of capped out do you remember anything else why it is important to be a business owner or anything important about owning a business it's important to own a business so like for example if you want to own a business first you have to you have to get the money for it and then and then you can start upgrading the the store or hair salon, whatever you're trying to, your career is. Like, for example, you, Daddy, um, you're, you are trying to own a business. So right now you're owning multiple houses and you're paying people to, um, you got the slingshot, you got the truck, you got the, you got the van, you got the motorcycle, you got the pools. And um, you're paying people to clean the house and um, take out all the bugs and take clean the pool. And because you're doing it for us, you you kind of like make the you making the money for our needs and what we and what me, Dominic, and Gavin, and Mama and your family want and. And you're trying to get a business, and that's why you want a lot of money. <laughs> yeah, we definitely do want a lot of money. But what we were talking about, or I think what I was trying to explain to her before, was that um, on my path to one day owning a brick and mortar business, is that um, you know, we're doing these small things, small steps along the way, like owning these rentals, owning the, the rental homes, and now venturing into um, automobile um, rentals. 
and saving all of that up and one day um, pursuing bigger, bigger stuff. But anyways, yeah, that's great talk, Rosalina. Appreciate your time. How old are you? I'm nine. I'm turning ten next year. So turning ten, and um, what's this? I'm trying to expose the kids to these, um, to these ventures, and, and teaching I, them. Please, my dad and me have a TikTok. He's getting a lot of followers. I'm getting a lot of followers. But please, I used to have an old account. I used to have a lot of followers, but it got banned for no reason. And I just want to say, um, please follow our. Or on the counts. What's your daddy? Honestly, I don't know the name of it. <laughs> <laughs> his is Rob and Truly. Mine is all lowercase Rosalina Domingo. Z the the so it's R lowercase R O S A L I N A D O M I N G zero three. <laughs>